<laughs> Hell, that's a bear, that's an original one. Now, 13 turns is enough to properly snap a neck. Now you see, a stool would be kicked away and Kathy's neck would snap. Take it away. <laughs> and the crowd would go crazy. Yeah, and somebody would take video of it to put it on YouTube later, apparently, yes. <laughs> See, come back to life, you're freaking me out. Oh. Okay, there we go, all right. That was, that was very odd. Now, that was all well and good, folks, but you guys want a real show, right? Yeah. Well, apparently not. Good night, folks. No, you see, say Kathy had some enemies in the crowd. You would uh, tip the hangman a little bit, and there would be not quite enough turns on the noose. It's not quite tight enough to snap her neck immediately. The stool would be kicked away. She would drop, her eyes would bulge, her tongue would stick out, her legs would kick wildly, take it away. <laughs> and she would join the cast of a chorus line, apparently. Yes, well done. All right, now, and this could happen for upwards of a half an hour. Now, if anyone out there loved her, they would run up and quickly yank on her legs, snapping her neck and ending her misery. Now, that is also where the phrase, you're pulling my leg came from, incidentally. That is true. Now, that was kind of a fun way to die, but say she had some more enemies in the crowd, you would tip the hangman a little more, and there would be far too many turns on the noose. It's way too tight. When the stool is kicked away, Kathy drops, and her head pops off and oh. flies into the crowd. <laughs> Take it away! Okay. Well done, okay, yes. She, okay, so, oh, okay, okay, give her a hand. Well done, well done. Oh, thank you. Oh, okay. Well played. You have, you have a long career in anything but the lively arts. Now, you see, the question is, what would happen to her body? Well, there has been instances of bodies hanging in the Boston Common for up to 20 years. But, sadly, you're not quite important enough, I'm sorry, to be buried in Copse Hill Burying Ground or the old Granary Burying Ground that we are about to go. No, folks, you are standing on the largest unmarked burying ground in the entire city, folks, Boston Common. There are more bodies under your feet right now than Copse Hill or the old granary. When they dug up to make room for the Park Street tea station over there, they found 300 bodies in there. And they moved all of them over to the central burying ground on the other side of the common. But, say, speaking of the old granary burying ground, let us go there now, huh? What do you say? Lots of famous folks buried there.